guys what's going on today another awesome day with some test rides um, today I'm riding the adventure segment so to speak I'm riding both the Suzuki DL 1000 XT and later on I will be riding the um, R1200 GS and it's pretty awesome and of course I'm starting on the Suzuki my last experience riding a Suzuki was the GSX S750 and I wasn't too impressed with that and I'm really uh, curious how this thing rides so far it's a little bit vibrating uh, underneath my ass um, but it sounds uh, it sounds pretty good again they have uh, mounted an acro system on it at motorport I really uh, I really enjoy the fact that they take the effort to um, to upgrade the sound of these test models uh, it's really half of the fun for me and I'm sure it is for uh, for you guys as well that's actually what I meant huge huge exhaust look at that thing So let's get comfortable with this thing real quick and see what it does. What? That is strange man. It accelerates so different. Or is it that I'm in um, traction control mode? I think it's no, it's one. That shouldn't be it. As soon as I hopped on this thing, my foot was quick shifting because of the experience on my MT09, uh, where I quick shift uh, gears up constantly. So my foot was pressing up without uh, putting the clutch for a minute. Let's not do that. I have the feeling that I'm so incredibly small riding this motorcycle. I'm not the biggest dude ever. But with this windscreen and uh, more motorcycle in front of me, I really feel small. get used to this screen in front of me it looks okay with this smoke uh, dark smoke screen I have the feeling that I'm not uh, having a very clear vision so maybe just need to get used to that probably I want to peek over this windscreen which is uh, ridiculous of course hmm this looks like a fun road for this type of a motorcycle shall I do it maybe a little later this gearing up it's uh, touchy I need to be a little more careful with the clutch geez I must say that the I was touching it earlier but it doesn't seem to do a whole awful lot check this out was barely braking actually nicely and in my head I'm uh, comparing this uh, to the Africa twin uh, I've been riding uh, a few months ago and that was uh, a DCT let's see uh, the automatic shifting system which was I thought it would be boring but it ended up to be very fun and I think these two models could be uh, pretty much comparable or they're more or less in the same segment Okay, let's go in the third sport mode. 
the most sporty one. And see if I can accelerate this thing. Ah, that goes way too easy. Able to uh, test the traction control. 